Hello everybody, um, this is a special request video. Um, I had a request to film what my master bathroom looks like because I decorate it with a lot of seashells and so um, here we go. So this is my master bathroom. Um, I mainly, I'm the only one who uses this bathroom. My husband uses the bathroom upstairs. The key to a happy marriage is definitely each have your own bathroom. So on this wall, I have this little shelf unit I got at Hobby Lobby, and I, I love picking up different glass jars that are shaped in shells and stuff. So probably got these jars at an estate sale, and then these are a mixture of shells that I have picked up in Sanibel, and then I also tend to rescue shells at thrift stores and estate sales. So definitely some of these are from thrift stores, but mainly um, I have picked them up. I can, like this I've got at Sanibel, um, and then these are all sand dollars that I got at Marco Island and a piece of coral I think I got at an estate sale and then just this cute little mermaid charm Hobby Lobby these are all sharks teeth these are all have we have these have all been collected by me and my husband um, none of these have been bought so we find sharks teeth at Manasito Key and St. Augustine Beach and we've been there three or four times, so that's why there are so many shark's teeth. And these big ones were found like out in the water. Like you can find the little ones washed up, but for the big ones, you kind of have to like actually go into the water and have a big scooper and scoop up stuff and hope you get lucky. So and this little shelving unit is from Hobby Lobby and it's just full of little mementos that I have picked up um, on beaches. These are all stuff I've picked up. Well, that one I bought but it, it's all stuff I've picked up. Um, just little smalls. And this is like another dish I picked up somewhere, just full of shells we've picked up and just more shells. And this is a tray I got in a stay cell and I use this to put my jewelry on before I take a shower. And then on the second row, this is jar full of sand dollars. These are bigger sand dollars. These, this is all sea glass, a jar of sea glass. These are little glass, um, I don't know what you call them, just little glass knickknacks that we got in Oregon on a vacation. Um, these, these ones are shaped like shells, so just a little memento from our vacation to Oregon. This huge shell we got at an estate sale. Um, it was actually a catering company going out of business. They used this for decoration at events. And most of the shells it came with, but several of them I've added from different trips. And then just more shells. I think this was from an estate sale. Um, this one of these Junos, Junios we got at a thrift store. The other two we found in Sanibel Island. And then this is just like potpourri with shells mixed in. Let's see. This is one of my favorite shells. Dishes. This is a huge shell dish we got at Hobby Lobby. It's full of uh, potpourri and shells that we have collected. And then just more jars full of shells that we have picked up on different trips. And then this, I got, uh, what do you call them? A sensei warmer. I just put new wax in, so that's why it's not melted yet. So, Hello, wearing my shark t-shirt for my shelling bathroom. Um, this is just a little container of the makeup I wear every day. Um, and this is, yes, the biggest display um, in the bathroom. So on the back, you see, that's like just a little lantern full of shells. That's from Hobby Lobby. Um, same thing, this was meant to be like a lantern, but I filled it with shells. From Hobby Lobby. You can tell I get a lot of stuff from Hobby Lobby and I don't pay full price. I always, when this stuff is 50% off, they always have the best beach stuff 50% off. Um, more shells. I think most of these I got in estate sale. This piece of coral belonged to my mother-in-law. All these little tulips we've got at Sanibel and I don't remember where those came from. This was from an estate sale. These are, um, well, I, now I can't even think of them. Japanese floats. My husband got those at an auction for me. This little um, little beach chair actually is my most recent purchase. I got this at Michael's a couple weeks ago. 
and then just another dish I found in an estate sale. These are all shells I picked up in, in Sandal. And this is just a little alligator I got at the Florida Everglades National Park. More shells. I think these I got in a estate sale. And then just the cute alligator I picked up at Savers. And then this is my this is from Clearwater. This was our September trip. This is all coral picked up in Clearwater. And then just a couple candles, more shells, and some that sea glass right there that we got in California. Those are rocks that we got in Oregon. And then I think this is shells that we picked up in California. Uh, but those two back jars are from Sanibel. And then this lantern that actually came as is, I did not decorate that at all. This actually has an electronic light in it and some cute jars and stuff that I picked up at Hobby Lobby. Um, some more shells, those are from Sanibel. And just bubble bath. These are rocks that we tumbled. These are rocks from Oregon. And then just different shells. I believe these are all from Sanibel. And then on above the toilet is the shelf. These are all jars. Um, they're just like the souvenir jars you get at like gift shops. The, um, they're full of, filled up sand and shells. I did not fill them up. You buy them that way. I love picking them up whenever we go on vacation. So they'll say like where they're from. That one says Carlsbad, that one says Sanibel. So most of them are store-bought, but several of them I made myself. But most of them are store-bought, even though it's just like a little kitschy, like souvenir, typical souvenir thing. I love picking them up. And then just, uh, I don't know, Mermaid, I got it. Hobby Lobby, these are more rocks that we tumbled. Um, I cannot remember what trip. I think this is, maybe this is, I think this is from Arkansas. And then a box I got Hobby Lobby and a shell that I got in a state cell. And then I just have hooks, anchor hooks on the wall for towels. And that's it. That is, oh, and then, oh wait, I got, this is a picture of me picking up shells in Sanibel. This is me and my husband. It's hard to see because of the glare. This was like our honeymoon. And then Robert picking up shells. And those frames were also from Hobby Lobby. Oh my God, I feel like I need to be sponsored by Hobby Lobby because I buy so much from them. Oh, did I show back here? So that's just a seashell basket full of extra towels. And then these are the bigger shells that are just huge. So, I don't know, just stuck them under there. And yeah, that's my bathroom. I'm just doing one more walk through, see if I missed anything. So we've, we kind of half redid this bathroom. like. It had gold fixtures. We put silver in. The only thing we did not change was the shower. You have to take the whole thing apart to be able to change it to silver, and we just weren't ready to do it at that time. So we will, we will, but when we do, it's basically you gotta gut the whole bathroom. So um, eventually we do plan on redoing this bathroom, but for now, I, I'm very happy with it. And let's see, what is my favorite? I think this box is my favorite. This was from Hobby Lobby and I just love all the small stuff I put in and I try to add something, a little something from each trip. So anyway, thanks for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons and I will see you later.